Hey everyone, this is Phil from the Cubicle. So yesterday I wanted to do some solves on the Tangyun V2, except I couldn't really decide what setting to use. So I had a crazy idea, which was why not do all of them and also film the process. So I filmed the process. Uh, in this video, you're gonna get an average of five non-rolling of every single setting combination between tension and elasticity. I didn't do the magnets because I know I like the, you know, the second middle choice. And also that would have multiplied my uh, solves by three, which would have uh, been kind of a disaster to, to um, edit. And uh, so I have the magnets set at two, but I go through all 16 combinations of tensions and elasticities. And I think I discovered a rule of thumb, which is to use the M slice as a benchmark. So essentially, I recommend starting at the lowest possible settings, 0.6 and zero for tension and elasticity. And then working your way up until you discover a point where your M slices are comfortable and you're not fumbling and the cube's not locking. Uh, when the tensions and elasticities were too low, the cube was really fast, except uh, the corner was catching on the center and the M slices were really unstable. And sometimes I got to, you know, last layer at like six seconds, but then I fumble a U-perm and it ends up ruining my solve. So that's no good, but uh, start at the lower end and work your way up until you discover settings that are good for you. Uh, the reason I'm starting at the low end also is, is that you want to keep the cube as fast and quick as possible because who doesn't like a fast and quick cube, right? So that's something that I learned. Of course, this is my personal opinion. You're welcome to use whatever standard that you develop yourself to adjust your cube. I just thought that using the M slice as a benchmark uh, was a really simple and effective way to, to do this. So without further delay, uh, let's watch some cubing and uh, you can see me make some mistakes here and there. Um, I hate to blame the, the hardware, the settings, but some of the uh, settings are quite hard to use, but I was surprised there were a lot of settings that were also really amenable to, to my cubing style. So let's take a look.
that's a plus two. 